So uh, my expectations for this year's SNRD conference was to exchange with colleagues, exchange with um, other projects, know what they are doing, understand what they are doing, and find out how best that can be integrated into my projects. What I do within my projects is um, human capacity development, that is trainings for our project beneficiaries. And um, we have um, quite a number of training approaches in GIZ, and most of them move across projects. And I would want to get information on how these training approaches are run in other projects, the best practices, the lessons learned, and how best that could be infused with what I do within my projects. I took part in one of the sessions um, on transforming mindsets where we had an input from Atingi. Atingi is an e-learning platform that is certified by GIZ and used um, across various projects within GIZ and outside GIZ. So um, in my projects currently, we are working on an activity for e-learning courses for cashew stakeholders. It is a new activity within our projects and we already started an um, exchange with Atingi. So me seeing someone from Atingi here at the conference um, gave me time to exchange with them, understand how the platform is used and understand how best it could be integrated into our context. So as an organizer of the conference and a community manager, the main objective I had was to bring colleagues together, colleagues from different projects within the countries in Africa, colleagues from the headquarters, from GLOBE, from FMB, to have a space to exchange, to have a space to get new ideas, and a space to share ideas on how we see the future for GIZs, how we see the future of the activities we'll be implementing. And I felt that um, that was done. We had ALs who were able to share with colleagues um, from the projects on what they expect from them and how um, they should go about with the activities. If I had a magic wand, I would um, put more money into developing policies and policy regulations for agricultural systems within Africa because in my perspective, I feel like that is the main point um, of attention if we want to promote the transformation of agricultural food systems.